is it that you do? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my summer morning routine. Now, as many of you know, I am a teacher, so my summer is running to an end, but um, I've been able to enjoy my mornings with my babies, so I am going to show you our typical morning routine. So it usually starts off by them jumping into my bed and waking me up. Sometimes I'll wake up before them if I need to get work done, but today was a very chill day at home. So I always start by brushing my teeth and then I go on to my skincare. My skincare in the morning is very simple. I always start by washing my face first. The cleanser that I'm currently using is from Cetaphil and it's a daily facial cleanser. I love this stuff because it is so gentle on my skin and it does not over dry it. A tip I've been implementing for some time now is pat drying my face instead of tugging on it when I dry because at the end of the day, we really need to be nice to our skin. I was actually being a little too abrasive with my Clarisonic, so I'm only using my Clarisonic once a week because I had broken capillaries around my nose. That's why it was so red. So I've been trying to apply this serum every single day. This is the one from Origins. It's her Mega Mushroom Relief and Resilience, and it's supposed to help soothe and calm all that redness going on. Now, I also pair that with the moisturizer. It's the same thing on the Mega Mushroom Skin Relief. And again, it's supposed to soothe all the redness. It does not have SPF, but I am trying to apply it every single day just to calm all that redness that I have. I've noticed a huge improvement on the appearance of my skin, but now I'm on the hunt for a good eye cream. So if you know of any, please comment down below because I need to do something about these dark under eye circles. As I'm doing my skincare, my son is usually right behind me. He's like my little tail and I swear there's like trucks in every room in my house. But after I'm done pampering myself just a little bit, I'm going to go ahead and change my son's diaper. And after we're going to head downstairs for some breakfast. <laughs> My kids will usually go straight to playing, but that's okay because it gives me time to prepare breakfast. But in this video, I also wanted to give you guys a huge thank you from the bottom of my heart. We have gained so many new subscribers here on this channel and I'm just completely grateful. So here my husband just left me a little note of encouragement to give me some motivation to continue going. And I love it when he leaves me little notes like this because it really does make a difference in my morning and just the way my day goes. It's really crazy how a few words of encouragement can really boost your day. So here, something else I've been trying to implement is filling up this tumbler with some water. And I usually fill it up maybe three times a day at most. Um, I'm not a huge water drinker, which is, I know it's totally bad, but I've been trying to drink out of this tumbler. I feel like getting a cute tumbler kind of helps with that. But here, I'm just making some pancakes for the kids. They love it when I make pancakes. It's her favorite type of breakfast. I don't make it too often, so they get pretty excited every time they smell the pancakes cooking in the kitchen, and I'd love to surprise them with that. Um, but anyways, along with the pancake, I'm also going to cut up some strawberries. My son currently is obsessed with strawberries. Like, it's his favorite type of fruit. Strawberries and bananas. Those two he can eat all day. Like the moon needs the sun about the others You set my world on fire You're my heart's desire I just wanna love you Just wanna hold you Just wanna be with you Till we grow old Please tell me you'll stay Or take me away I want you for myself every single day You set my world on fire You set my world on fire I don't know what I'd do without you You make me smile, what is it that you do? You're my heart's desire 
Now that our bellies are all full, I'm going to clean my son's hands from all that sticky syrup using wet ones. I usually keep them in one of our kitchen drawers just to have them handy and he doesn't have to touch things with his sticky hands. I'm going to put the kids to play for a little bit more and I'm going to get a little bit of cleaning done. I don't get a lot of cleaning in the morning just because my house gets so messy throughout the day that it's not even worth cleaning it at this point. But I do go ahead and tidy up the kitchen. One of the things I always do is unload the dishwasher from the dishes I had running the night before. And it just makes your day go a lot smoother just because right after breakfast, I usually load the dishes from breakfast. And then as we're done with lunch, I'll load lunch dishes and dinner and so on. So at the end of the night, whatever dishes don't get to fit in the dishwasher, I just wash them by hand. I am going to be washing some dishes by hand right now in the morning just because I know I'm going to be using them later on in the day. As some of you might have already noticed, we are in the process of redecorating our master bedroom and also the kids' bedrooms. I already got a new bed for Matt. Um, he's no longer in his crib because unfortunately he would jump out of it very soon, so we got rid of his bed. But we are currently updating our bedroom furniture and I can't wait to show you some bedroom tours later on, so stay tuned for that. So like I said, my cleaning routine in the morning is super simple. I just tackle the kitchen and tidy up the bedrooms. So now I'm going to change for the day because I do need to run some errands and I'm just wearing a tank top. It's been crazy hot here in Miami, Florida. So I'm just going to go in with a very light moisturizer. This is actually a tinted moisturizer so it will give me a little bit of coverage but not so much. It's very light. I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer to conceal my under eye circles and then I'm going to use this highlighter from ColourPop. It's their Super Shock Cheek. Now <laughs> that is a tongue twister but it has a beautiful pearlized finish to it so I'm applying a little bit underneath my eyebrow and also in the inner corners and sometimes I will go in with just a little bit on the tip of my nose. I'm also going to apply some blush and my favorite mascara. It's the one from L'Oreal. And now I'm packing some snacks so that we can have something to eat um, while we're running errands. I always like to pack some snacks on the go because quite honestly, it's the only thing that keeps my toddler calm in the store. Just give him food and he will make a fuss. We will be shopping for school supplies today, so I got my daughter's list. You guys are ready? Mm-hmm. Matt's ready. No. Mia's ready no. for the pool. No! <laughs> 
I will be dropping off Mia with her grandma at the pool because I'm telling you guys, it's been crazy hot these days here in Miami. So she's going to soak up all the sun at the pool while I go shopping for her school supplies. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe and become a part of the Mom Life Balance. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye guys. You set my world on fire